Vegas full walkthrough. It uh, has been some time since I've posted a video because Fallout 4 has taken over my life. Uh, I apologize, but you know how it is. Uh, most of you probably aren't even interested in watching Fallout New Vegas walkthrough anymore <laughs> and are patiently waiting for me and other people to post their Fallout 4 game play walkthrough material. Um, I have pledged to finish this walkthrough before moving forward with Fallout 4. I really am enjoying the Fallout 4 series. Uh, let me, sorry, let me just pause here. Uh, to let you know what I'm up to, I am going to Nellis Air Force Base to help out the boomers uh, in the quest called Volaire. And then after that, um... We might do some some work with the NCR, I'm not sure, but uh, I'd like to uh, get that uh, northern part of the map done, and if you're wondering where Nellis Air Force Base is, is it's located up here, but it actually isn't on the map. Um, well, it is, but it's, it's, it's very secluded, so. Anyway, so we're going to fast travel there. So we are at Nellis Air Force Base, and um, we previously had come here in the past to try and um, gain access, which we successfully have done. Um, <clears throat> so now that we can come freely and go freely from Nellis Air Force Base, um, it'll be a lot easier for us to uh, help them out and kind of wander around. But in lieu of not posting any videos to uh, my channel on my Fallout New Vegas walkthrough, um, I have been t playing Fallout 4 quite religiously, and uh, I'm enjoying the game. It's uh, very, very nice, very well done. Uh, there obviously are some glitches, as is always expected, uh, with any of Bethesda's uh, games and other game developers, for that matter. Um, but Glitches aside and bugs aside, I, I think that they've really quite done um, uh, a very good job of uh, making Im marked improvements from previous Fallout games and also um, just overall, you know, the quality and the, and the graphics in the game are, are a lot better. So I kind of have a feeling that they've taken kind of the canned um, uh, infrastructure that was used to build uh, Skyrim and uh, have used that to build Fallout 4, but um, which is something that I've actually suggested in uh, the past, uh, not to them, but I mean, something that I would like to have seen in the past uh, is the, for them to use Skyrim um, mapping and, and, and kind of the basis Hi. that's used that game. Hi! Oh, 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 and she's gone. Okay, she vanished out of thin air. Excellent. Um, all right. Uh, well, anyways, so with the with this Volair quest, um, Nellis Air Force Base um, is a compound that's now called home to a faction called the Boomers, and uh, they're known they're known for their extremely potent. Um, howitzer defenses, and they are initially extremely aggressive to any visitors that come, but uh, they calm down and can become 
uh, allies once you prove your worth to them. Uh, before you begin, uh, we have to learn numerous ways we can approach uh, this Volar quest. Um, the first way in which we can approach it is that um, it can be started at any time, however, the factions uh, that we may have been working with uh, to support the main quest, um, you, you want to make sure that they that they support the boomers uh, regardless. So what we should do um, is we can there's there's several ways that we can do this quest um, and there is um, you can speak to, well, I mean, they all start by speaking to Mother Pearl, and then she says, um, well, we need some help around uh, around the base. And she said, well, okay, so we have the option to help with the injured, uh, repair the solar arrays, complete Ant's quest, help Jack's love, and also listen to Boomer history. Um, and so when you listen to Boomer history, you actually speak to Pete and listen to the story about Meryl, but... Um, it's important not to interrupt him while he talks. And then, of course, after that, uh, you have to further inquire about Boomer history, which leads you back to Mother Pearl. I found. Oh, sorry, my phone is going crazy. Uh, and then you, th and then after that, um, after you complete any one of those five um, sub quests within Volaire, you actually return to Mother Pearl, and then she points you to uh, speak with Loyal, who can either tell you to head to Lake Me to locate the bomber, or to speak with Jack to get the rebreather, and then once you return to Jack with a pressure cooker, and then um, you, with the signs of 45 or higher, you can convince him that you don't need a pressure cooker, um, but if you return to him with a pressure cooker, he will make you the rebreather in which you can use to bring the, bom the bomber up from the bottom of Lake Mead. Um, so once you have completed all of that stuff, that basically sums up all of the work that needs to be done in Nellis Air Force Base. So the first thing is um, I'd like to go and talk to... Where are we closest to? Uh, maybe Jack's love. All right, so we are inside. I can take care of that robot problem for you. Nah, you leave my robot alone. I think this is the mess hall, and this guy's walking in a table. I'm not sure if Jack is kicking around in here, actually. Um, he may or may not be. We might have to go to the, one of the other buildings, but there should be a marker in here. Um, yeah, in here. Da, da, da. Nope, that's out. Um, what? I don't think that there's a marker in here. Okay, um... Well, let's head back out then. Yeah? Huh. <laughs> this guy looks way too young to even have a deep voice like that. But it's, you know, the Fallout New Vegas series has this set number of, uh, voices that they use for all of their actors so I guess it's when you have a budget you know and you have to kind of start slashing things that's it's kind of uh, you know one of the places to start anyways it's the hangar that we have to go in sorry guys so when you go in this hangar um, make your way to the back far end here 
where they have their little shop and stuff and and Jack is kicking around here somewhere if we can just find him there he is so you're the outsider lived your whole life out there huh Wow I always thought you savages probably spoke a different language but I hear you sound like us yep me I work with loyal mostly electronics work in robotics keeping the old technologies alive right well, can you tell me about Loyal? Loyal's a great man, but he's getting on in years. So a younger's got to learn everything he knows. That'd be me. The man knows how to fix and build just about everything that was ever made. It's not easy keeping up with him. If you help him recover the lady, I figure... Oh, I figure it's been a nice day. Yeah, a real nice day. Uh, what are you talking about? Did I say that? Sometimes I just say stupid things. Pearl will tell you when the time comes. If... Wait, 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 wait. Hey there. I'm not Act. done speaking to you yet. I'm looking for ways to help out. Anything come to mind? What I could use is some scrap metal. It may not sound exciting, but around here we have to recycle every rivet and plate. The other thing, you being from the outside and all, well, I guess you'd call it a personal matter, but... Well... Uh, forget it. Speech 35. Where I come from, we discuss personal matters all the time. That must be nice. Sharing yourself like that? Yep. Not being embarrassed or anything? Yep. Well, the thing is, there's this girl. Okay. Tell me more. Oh, you can't miss her. She has short red hair and she's the most beautiful woman who ever lived. You'd really talk to her for me? Sure. What if she feels the same way? I'm sure she will. What if will. she comes here like you did? She will. What if she gets blown up? She won't. What if she doesn't like me? She may or may oh, not. Oh, jeez. I better just let you handle it. I'm better with machines. They don't make my stomach queasy like this. Dude, grow some balls. Uh, I'll look into it. Stranger things have happened. That would be amazing. As in... Alright, so now we have to... And we have the quest added young hearts. Um, now we have to uh, make those two fall in love. And if you go to your quests... Um, this is the... Um, this is the quest that we can do now, um, and the nice, you know, the nice thing about Fallout 4 is that you can actually select more than one quest. Like, if you wanted to have Volaire and Young Hearts both selected, you could do that. But let's, uh, try and fi find Jack's love interest. Um, we have to go back out into the base to locate her. Uh, not here. This one. Okay, and where is she? There is this woman. Um, oh god, she's like halfway across the Mojave. Alright, so off to the Crimson Caravan Company we go. Alright, so, um, as I said in the, in the previous screen, we are doing the side quest, um, Young Hearts. It's part of Volaire. And Jack has asked us to go and find this red-haired woman. Uh, apparently she's the most beautiful woman in all the wasteland, but we will be the judge of that. That fiend leader shouldn't have messed with our great army. You should go talk to Blake Janet. or Alice. They handle most... I don't suppose you watch the boomers over in Nellis sometimes, do you? I watch all sorts of things with my binoculars. Who wants to know? And why? Uh, I've been inside Nellis. There's a young man there who has a crush on you. Nice looking blonde boy? I always wondered if he was watching me back. What's he like? He's nice. Maybe a little naive. Seems convinced you're the love of his life. Really? Oh, that's so sweet. I'd love to go meet him. Is there any way the boomers would let me visit Nellis? Uh, I'll ask Pearl to make an exception for you. This is so exciting. Let me know how it turns out. Alright, so now we have to go back and talk to Pearl. Um, how do I get out of this thing? Ask Pearl for permission for Janet to enter Nellis. So, we go back to Nellis. Alright, we are back in Nellis Air Force Base. Air, Air Force Base. <clears throat> Excuse me. And uh, we need to talk to Pearl. Pearl's located in Madison. She's around the side. Yeah. 
Okay, Pearl, where are you? There you are. How is your visit with us going, stranger? Great, thanks. Jack is interested in a girl. Well, well, this is welcome news. Who is she? She works for the Crimson Caravan. She's with those traitors? They've tried to contact us before, but I'm not interested in... This presents a bit of a problem. Jack isn't allowed to leave Nellis, and... It would mean a lot to Jack if she could come to Nellis. Hmm. I suppose Jack deserves a chance at love. You can tell Jack she has a free pass to enter, but he... Do not make me regret... Uh, you tell me. What do you... Um... Blah, 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 blah. Okay, I don't want to talk to Bye. you. Bye. Okay, tell Jack Janet is interested. Cool. So now we need to go and find Jack. Whoops. And he's in the hangar, uh, which is back here. The only thing I don't, uh, there's a lot of different things, you know, about Fallout New Vegas and Fallout 4. Fallout New Vegas, you can't run. Um, running is basically what you see here, but in Fallout New Vegas, you can actually use action points um, to run even faster, which is kind of neat. Whoops. Uh, okay, so... I think what I'll do is I'll do, like, in my commentary for this, um... For this gameplay, I'll start to compare things to Fallout 4 and, and just, uh... Kind of give my feedback on that. Have you seen her? The redhead of my... Yep. She does? You... Yep. What happens next? Yep. I spoke to Pearl, but Janet needs a way to pass the artillery. Here. Take this boomer outfit. I'll let the gunners know she's coming. Ugh. Now we have to go back to the Crimson Caravan and give her the boomer outfit. And you know, in theory, we don't really have to give her the boomer outfit. That's the other thing about Fallout 4 that I like, is uh, when you fast travel to, say, like, Diamond City or, or Settlement, you actually um, spawn inside of the settlement, which is uh, nice, because you don't have to go through another load screen, so... Hello again. How's your boomer friend? He's uh, kind of horny. You really need to get down to Nellis Air Force Base. I was hoping you would. What's going on? Have they agreed to my safety yet? Um, I got a boomer uniform for you to wear while you cross the There's Nellis. There's one more thing. I have a work contract with the Crimson Caravan, and if I walk away, I lose the win. Could you do just one more thing for me and talk to Alice McLafferty about it? I know if I do it, she'll just say no. This girl wants the best of both worlds. I'll believe that the fiends are gone when they stop their This is some of the, th you know, you gotta sacrifice. If you want love in your life, maybe you gotta sacrifice your paycheck. Okay, I'm just gonna cut the radio before we get accosted by YouTube copyright law. Welcome back. Janet's asked me to talk to you about releasing her from her contract. Ah, yes. Her infatuation with a boomer she's never met. It's a small camp. More gets around. She's aware she's breaking her contract, which is undoubtedly why she sent you to talk to me instead of coming herself. Janet is free to leave, but she forfeits the wages she's owed. That's the price of contract breaking. Take it or leave it. Um, I need to consider your offer. Okay, so this is what I'm going to do. I'm going to exit out of this conversation dialogue, and I'm going to read a magazine so that I can hopefully convince her. Uh, that is, if I have a magazine. Repair, energy weapons, survival lockpick, damage from speech. There we go. Here we go. Welcome back. Yep. Ah, oh, still not high enough. Uh, okay. Mentats. I'm gonna take some Mentats. Welcome back. Because I think, as you know, Mentats... Yeah, see, speech 75. Are you really going to ruin what's supposed to be a time of happiness for her? Being sentimental is not how I made the Crimson Caravan so successful. But I'll Janet will be paid what she's owed. There you go. All right, so now we just have to let Janet know, and that will be that.
Then we'll head back to Dallas Air Force Base. Hmm. Have you spoken with McLafferty yet? Sure have. I convinced her to pay you what you're owed. You're free to leave. That's great. I can't believe you went through all this trouble for me. Thank you. She's got the boomer outfit, and now she's on her way. So what we're going to do is actually travel back to Nellis Air Force Base. All right, so now we just got to talk to Jack. Hi. I can't believe I'm going to meet my red-headed lady soon. I'm really nervous about it. Um, can you think of any ways I can help out? Like... Okay, so he's done. There's no other dialogue to engage with him. So, um, now we're going to move on to the next side quest. But before we do that, I think what we'll do is... We might just end... Well, I'll, I'll start the second side quest. And then we'll end the video and pick up in the next one. Um, first thing I need to do, though, is eat some food. Do I have a steak here? Or something? Uh, nothing. There she is. Wait, come back. Girl. <laughs> She's running. I'm in love, Jack. Jack, come back. Come back. It would be funny if um, her name was actually Rose and it was like a reference to Titanic. But it's Janet. Very anticlimactic. Okay, girl, don't stop running. I need to talk to you for a minute. God, wasting my life. Okay, wait, stop running. I gotta talk to you. Are you done? Oh my gosh. Well, we'll just keep following her until she gets to Jack. really bad. There we go. <sighs> you know, ten years from now we're gonna look back in this game and go, wow! I can't believe it was the way that it is. There we are. Hello. It's great to finally meet you. Hi there. It's great to meet you as well. I'm glad you made it out here. You're even more stunning up close than you were at a distance. And you're even more handsome up close. Do you think it'll be okay if I hang around here for a little while, so we can get to know each other better? Of course hey. it would. I'll have you set up with some quarters with some of the other women. Okay, now let's talk to Jack and figure our stuff out. Thank you for getting Janet to Nellis. I've never been so happy in my entire life. Okay, cool. So Hi. we're done that side quest. Accepted. The folks have come to accept you for your help for helpful nature. Okay, so the next, if we go into our quests again, 
la, la, la. and we select full layer it'll point us in the next direction but for now I'm going to end the video here and we'll pick up in the next one so if you like this click the like button subscribe to my channel make any comments you feel free to to leave for us and um, if you would like to see anything different please give me some feedback uh, and share this uh, video amongst others with your friends and don't forget you can find the rest of these on my youtube channel vendertron and my website vendertron.com thanks again for watching we'll see you next time